Okay, so Mix and Ballistic Squire isn't as confusing or convoluted as it may seem at first when you see the instructions. So what we want to do is remove the cap on B. We'll remove the cap on A. And then we're going to pour B into A. And this is a little tricky holding the phone at the same time, so bear with me. Okay. Then we need to screw our cap back onto A. This is important. And shake it for 20 seconds. 19, 20. I can already feel it getting warmer. And so now what's important is you need to loosen that cap so it can vent. That's extremely important. And what we're going to do now is we're waiting for this to come up to temperature. And it has to reach 135 degrees within five minutes. And I'll see if I can focus in on this. They have this little sticky thermometer in the back. And it's, there we go. Well, that's hard to focus, so. But you can see it's already starting to come up. Now, as a backup, you can use an infrared thermometer like this one here, okay? And we put it on there. We can see we're already at 111 degrees and climbing, okay? So it's probably going to reach it here fairly quick. Now, for some reason... It does not hit 135 degrees or greater within five minutes. What you do is you screw the cap back on, give it another shake, set it down, and loosen the cap again. Okay, it's been close to five minutes, and we're going to check this. There we go, 135.2 degrees. Okay, so because we reached 135 degrees, we're going to let this set for 30 minutes. And uh, once we reach that 30 minutes, we'll tighten the cap back up, give it a quick shake, loosen the cap, and then we need to wait and let it cool down. Okay, so our 30 minutes is up. So we tighten the bottle. Give it a quick shake, loosen the cap again, and now we're going to wait approximately an hour for it to drop below 100 degrees. So once it's below 100 degrees, we will add our C component. So let's see where we're at here. Here we go. 98 degrees and it's been about 40 45 minutes all right so what we need to do so we'll open it back up and now we're going to pour our C contents into here There we go. Screw the lid back on. Shake it for about 15 seconds. All right. And you can loosen the cap or you can even remove it. It just needs to, uh, to sit for about five more minutes to sweat. And then we'll pour it in the can and we'll be ready to apply it.